Welcome to Deconstructing Chatbots. I am Priyanka Vergadia, and in today's episode, we are going to explore how to integrate dialogue flow with Telephony Gateway. The other day, I was talking to a friend about chatbots and he said, Priyanka, it would really help me if I could just assign a phone number to the chatbot that I already have built. That way, I can provide the same experience to my users across the phone and web. Well, that led me to this episode. So today we are going to work with the same appointment scheduler chatbot that we built in the previous episodes and integrated with the telephony gateway so our users calling on the phone can get the same experience as the ones on the web. Now, remember that this is a feature in beta, so you may want to let us know how you're using it so that we can keep improving it. Let's get in our Dialogflow console and locate our agent, appointment scheduler, with our intents. We are going to go into integration section where we enabled our web and Google Home integration. This time we will select Dialogflow phone gateway. It allows you to select the country for the phone number and in next step, you choose the phone number. I'm good with the default selection and we'll just finish it here. Once you finish, you see the congratulations message indicating a phone number that's assigned to your bot for your users to call in. Now, as you can see in yellow, the phone number you get is valid only for 30 days if you're using standard edition. If you're a business, you definitely want a permanent number, so for that, you should be using enterprise edition. Let's place a call to our bot at 267-281-5159, which is the number that we assigned. Hello, how can I help you? Schedule an appointment for 4 p.m. tomorrow. What services are you looking to get? DMV offers driver license and vehicle registration services. Driver's license? You are all set for your driver's license on the 25th of January 2019 at 16 hours, 0 minutes and 0 seconds. See you then. All right, so my friend is really happy now that he can just assign a phone number to his chatbot and provide the same experience across web and phone channels. Don't miss the next episode of Deconstructing Chatbots because we are going to learn more about entities. If you like this video and would like to see more of this content, then please like and subscribe to our channel.